stroked his shadow's head, mumbling sweet words under his breath. Him and his shadow had always had a complex relationship. It was more romantic than anything, without anyone else who cared for him besides his mother and brother. It only made sense in his mind. He gently nuzzled Shadow's cheek. What would I do without you, my Shadow? You are always there for me, even when I treat you badly. I can never leave your side, even when you act unnaturally. <laughs> You're lovely, you know that. You tell me every day. And I mean it every day. He was caught up as the gods dragged in a small child and mother. The child was bawling her eyes out, and the mother was struggling, trying to protect her little girl. Tom stood, and so did Shadow. Wow, what do we have here? Lot bigger, sir. They both spoke out of bounds, sir. Tom nodded and pressed the button on his remote, opening the pool of dark water below. Fire in the woman. Hold the child. Tom always did this whenever a small child was involved. He never killed them, but he would give them examples. The guards approached the pool, and as the woman realized she was about to meet her fate, she let, she let out one last desperate cry. Chloe! Before she was thrown into the pool, her daughter stared silently, tears streaming down her face, as her mother became nothing more than an empty skeleton. Tom closed the pool and crouched as to be at eye level with the girl. Do you understand now? Why don't we speak? Chloe nodded silently, and the guards took her away out of the room, out of the palace, and threw her out into the streets, which would, from then on, become her home. <laughs> <laughs>